Hey guys, it's Luke here and we're back with another episode of Crusader Kings 2 The Last Curling. So as you can see we are starting again. It didn't go very well. Um, I think we died of the Great Pox which was probably quite shot to kill us. So we're gonna try again. I, uh, undeterred, I feel that Countess Adele here can make a proper go of things and fulfill her otherworldly ambition of becoming the god empress of mankind. Um, so we're gonna not take an ambition, we're gonna rush through all this. We, I think I'm gonna go for the seduction focus. I'm gonna go for the seduction focus, try and seduce ourselves a nice young man um, who can give us a, a bastard who will then legitimize and we'll have an heir who's from our dynasty. Once again, however, I'm going to plot to kill my husband. Oh, it's not actually in there. Just have to manually do that. There we go. This time, my mother is not interested. Disappointing, to say the least. However, perhaps with a bit of gold and a title, she'll get involved. Go, invite to plot. No? You're weird. Okay. So we're gonna do the borrowing thing from the Pope, uh, from the Jews, as usual. Uh, set all our councils going. This time, I'm first of all gonna increase relations with the king. Then all the rest is gonna be practically the same. Uh, make the Pope like us again. Alright, and we're ready to tick. Once we marry our brother, Dude. Ooh, we don't have um, the Duchess this time. Interesting. Instead, we'll get an alliance with the Byzantines. And we'll begin. Limited Crown Authority again. It's fine. Um, once again, we'll make a militia training ground here. Okay, they've got married. Excellent. Crusades begin again. All the. F yep, they're all forming. And immediately we're at war France and crusading for Greece. Um, I'm not too fussed about the crusader trait. I think we've got more important things to do at the minute. I'm going to actually try and seduce <laughs> the same guy. He seemed quite privy to it before, so perhaps we'll um, manage to seduce him on this playthrough. Count Baudouin. You know you want it. Cool. Uh, I made sure to attend a minor event in Gaines in the hopes of uh, seducing Count Baldwin, but he remains unimpressed. I'll keep practicing my fantastic seduction skills. I will certainly succeed. Right. We're also for some reason in a war with Norway. Ooh, I see. The attraction is growing. Um we're gonna make a lewd suggestion. Ah we've we have we have come, we've we've seen, we we've came mm, and conquered. Oh shit. Well we've been seeing adultering again. Shit. Oh well. We don't really mind if we're known adulteress, do we? Um, it's true. Can't be denied. Uh, who shall we adulter with next? The King of France, perhaps? Let's seduce the King of France. That way, if we got busted with the King, um, he would potentially have a claim on the Kingdom of France. Uh, make a lewd suggestion. Success! The king was into that sort of shit. Hopefully, one of the two men will have gotten us pregnant. Well, right, let's just keep seducing kings. Um, it is going to be a scandal if they found out, isn't it? Oh, I am with child. 
shit though. It's um This is not good, man. It's um He thinks it's his. That's not Why do you think it's his? Why do you think it's yours? You know that I'm an adulteress. Be suspicious. Ugh, fuck you, William. Um You. No. You. No, you're all old. Fuck's sake. You're bald. I want an attractive guy. There we go. You'll do. Oh no, you're a cousin. Can't have you. It's weird. The Duke of Champagne. That's fine. Come on then. Let's get it on. Let's get it on. How is the war going for the French? Look, looks like it's not going very well at all. Uh, ah, there, I guess there's no rush. We're already pregnant after all. Hopefully, um, the baby doesn't look like the Count. In that case, he will suspect things, I think. I'm gonna seduce the Pope. The idea of seducing Pope Gregorius VII, a man of the cloth, is so exciting. Yet, I am definitely risking a scandal here. It will certainly be worth it. The Pope's gonna love this ship. He, he needs to take his mind off the, the crusade that's not going very well, so... He's not around. There's a shock. It might be because he's off crusading. Fair play to him, I suppose. If he's leading an entire crusade at like his age, what is he like? Sixty years old. Go on, son. You have that crusade. You have a great time over there. Um Byzantines have declared a war from the care again. We've had a son, Hughes. Uh that's not good. We want to become Queen of France. This guy needs to go. How how on earth do I get rid of this kid? Um, I'm not too sure. You can't kill your children, which is really inconvenient. Um, Uncle backs that plot. Hmm. Does mean game over. Could we have elective monarchy? We could do that, I think. We need to have a bastard child, legitimize it, and then elect it as our rightful heir. That, I think, will be the only way we can get around this. Um, let's seduce the king again. Hopefully that'll work. Uh, this war is pointless. Such a tiny war. Yudis and the princess have had a baby. Named after my mother, that's quite nice. Pope likes me. Um, for some reason. Ish. Okay, no one who we're seducing is around. So let's seduce the bald guy here. He is definitely at home. I can tell. Go to location. Yep, he's there. He must be seductible. Seductible, that's a word. I didn't just make that up. I'm to stay away forever. Wow, that is very, very for forcible, isn't it? Fine then, the bishop it is. Yes, yes, the scandal. The scandal. To be fair, at this point, any bloke could do. This guy's a genius, apparently. We should, we should bang him. We should take a note from, um... No, I'm not gonna... <laughs> Yeah. 
Let's go full on blend and just risk everything. Look mate, you should create the Duchy of Valois and then give it to me. Since we shared so much. Wink wink. Uh, sinister Force has been at work. Oh no. The weak man doesn't like me. That's a shame. Uh, how goes the crusade? Shit. Goes shit. Just as badly as this war. However, the Scots, I think, are beating the Norwegians, or the other way around. Yeah. Yeah, we're on the Scottish side. Beating the Norwegians, kicking them out of Northern Scotland. Taking this province. That's nice, I suppose, for the Scots. Not really for us, we don't really care. To start, we're landlocked, so it doesn't even affect us at all. At least we haven't died. Like, by this point last time, we had the grape, we had syphilis, we were stressed and lunatic. Um, this time, we're not ill. But we do have a child that's not that dynasty. It's really inconvenient. When will I have reigned for 10 years, I wonder? Alright, I took to the throne as it were on 1080, so we've got another 6 years and 2 months yet. That's a fair amount of time really, but this gives us plenty of time to have a child I suppose. Um, didn't I try and seduce this guy? Oh, he died, okay. Seduce the new one then. He's younger, he'll be into it. We're both zealous, he'll be well, well into that shit. Oh, nice chest there. Chance he won't be into it. Oh, and I'm not zealous. I thought I was. <gasps> oh, he's ruined my loom. He's ruined my loom. Common disaster. He is feisty, though. Let's uh, let's go after him. Try and seduce the prince bishop here. Oh, how, how thrilling that is, isn't it? There's not much to do at the minute. I'm just going to look through my tooltips. Oh! He started rumours about me. He started rumours that I've been with a horse. You cheeky bugger. A priest should not be spreading such falsehoods. I'm disgusted. I would never do things with a horse. Unless the horse gave me a child that was not this bastard here. Um, okay, elective succession faction, we're not interested. Point successor. Ooh. Ooh. Vassal bishops. We're gonna appoint our uncle to be the successor to that bishop. Oh no. He he took a shit in my toilet. It's not very nice, is it? I mean this guy this guy really knows how to please the ladies. Um Manasse. You are an asse uh, as it were. You ass a hole. Uh, we're losing we're gonna lose the war against the Germans. Ah, finally he tells me to stay away forever. Jesus, he took his time with that one. Fine. I'm sure there's someone we can seduce. This guy's got the same name. Manasseh seems to be a very common French name, considering I've never actually seen it in the game before. There's two of them next to each other. Interesting. Ah, he sent me a dagger. Now that's either a really nice gesture, is it? Oh look, I want you I want you to be protected. Have a lovely dagger. Or I fucking hate you, you crazy bitch. Stay away from me or I'll stab you. I'll shank you nan. Um I hope it's the former, not the latter though. Um because I, I think our nan's dead. Yeah, so he wouldn't get very far. Leave him a note to meet us by the stream. Oh he wants us to fucking leave away stay away forever. Look, these guys just don't know what they're missing, do they? Old man. You seduced Eustace of Boulogne. Well, he was one of the followers 
of William the Conqueror. And he was re he got really angry because William didn't give him much land. Uh, so he, he did a rebellion. <laughs> and that didn't work out too well for him either. Ooh, we got a tithe at least. That's nice. Aha, he sent me a dagger again. More daggers, that's nice. Oh, we got a Greek woman in there. Ooh, another tithe. Who's my steward? Brother, you are doing a great job. I like you. And your wife. Your wife and I should enter intimate uh, lesbian relations. Has he gone to war? He fucking has. You prick. Uh, let's try and get temperate. Nope. Didn't work. Oh, he's back at home. Okay, excellent. Let's seduce that bastard. Uh, leave him a note. <gasps> Ooh, make a loose suggestion. Yes! Um. Hmm. They raised some eyebrows. Ooh. Um. Do we take him as a lover? Or should we let our love grow? Um. We'll let our love grow. Of course. We'll try and get. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> Everyone's seen this, isn't it? Aren't they? Um. Oh well. We're already a known adulteress. It's not gonna really harm our image much more. Our sex appeal is well up there. Everyone wants a piece of this ass. Right. We're approaching 1085. It was just after 1085 when we last died. Ooh. Mead in my room, me lord. Alright, we got another one. I'm lustful now. Oh, excellent. That's just what we needed. Now, I was gonna... There was a mare, wasn't there, in my domain? Okay. Let the autosave do the thing. There was a mare here who is genius. Let's seduce our own mare. You will be mine. He's also my diplomat. That's quite nice. Uh, da -da -da -da. What can we build? Not much. I need more practice. Yes. Build that while we're waiting. Not much else going on. Ooh, tell a white light to Hughes. Come on, suspect something. Expose me. Well, not in that way. Expose my foul deeds, please. Okay, we're getting there with our mayor. Find out that I'm a dirty hoe. Come on, husband. You're the worst. He's such... He's so shit. Aha, oh, he's asking if the child's not his. It's not, it's not yours. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked. Uh, the virtue is strong in this one. Let's have him. Um, ha <laughs> ha. He's gonna know. He's gonna know that it's a bastard now. Yeah. <laughs> Unfaithful harlot, minus 300. Yes, boys. Okay, we've got this guy. This mayor is ours. Oh dear. The band of brothers have been brought before me. Off with their heads! Um, Count Hugh, that's my husband, who cares about him. I'll get prestige and I'll lose opinion with him. Fuck it, yeah. I hate you. All about the prestige. Oh, we are not very pious. We've been fucking too many blokes. Jesus. Oh, I am even titled the unchast. Come on. Oh, we've got him. All the lovers that have come before, they don't compare to him. Right. He's lustful too. He's totally into that shit. Alright, we've now got three lovers. We've got a bastard baby on the way. This dynasty is going to be secure. What if I seduce the bishop? Hello, bishop. Oh, you're easily seducible. Hopefully. I fear the Lord too much. I do not fear the Lord. 
I think that's evident by now. Um, let's have a zoom. Oh, let's confess my love. Oh, stay away forever. Shit. <laughs> oh well. Crusade is now actually going in our favour. That's quite nice. Who is winning? King Gudrid of Surya. Aha. Uh -huh. That's the, this guy. Descendant of Ivar the Boneless. All the way up here. Yep. Ivar the Boneless. Aha, look. We have a son. I have a bastard. Can I legitimize him? Oh, he's at his father's court. Oh, he's here. Oh, they've, the bloody fathers choose to legitimize them, don't they? Fuck. Shit. Oh, no. If I get 20 piety, I can do it. I can do it. By indulgence for my sins. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Mr. Pope. He's given us absolution. Oh, holy father. You know that I'm truly one of your flock. Um, how do we recover our piety? It will recover over time. Probably in the next five years or so. Which is when it needs to be. We'll be able to legitimize our new son. Aha! My lover! Now si Haha! <laughs> perfect! So getting him as a lover has made him want to kill my husband. That's ideal. We're a daughter, I don't give a shit what happens to you. My brother will educate you. Actually, I guess I can marry you off for alliances. Um, the Duke of Laurel Lorraine. Are you a son of the Emperor? Yeah. That's not going to get us very far though. Um, I'll marry you to the King of Poland. That'll be a nice match in about 10 years when you're of age. Right. Just so need this piety to climb, that's all we need. How much piety did we need? With 20. That's really not much. If we hadn't been fucking so many guys, we'd have that. We'd have that down. Can we uh, do another indulgence? No. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Uh. Right. I really want to seduce the Pope. He's at home now. I might succeed. Ha ha. Let's do it. It's piety. It's pious Pope. I am a pious lady who needs a jolly good seeing too. Right, he likes me, that's a bonus. Hello, Uncle. Keep doing the shit. Um, I'm assuring him of my faithfulness. Oh, can we do it? We've banged the Pope! Alright, how can I end it with one of my lovers? Count of Ruin? Break up with the Count of Ruin. Who likes us the least? I believe it is him. But then, Eustace of Boulogne here. Yeah, he's old. Get rid of you. Get out of town. Let's fall in love with the Pope. Oh ha ha! The Pope loves me. <laughs> the Holy. <laughs> he's not. <laughs> oh, he's really not. You're a bad Pope. Um. I wish I could get you out of this. I'd be able to get money off him if I had piety. Still need a papal indulgence. Need more piety. 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 If I had 300 gold, I'd be able to donate to the uh, hospitals or the Templars to get this equivalent piety. Aha! The husband! I can get rid of him at last. Potentially. See if this let's see if this works. And we'll be married in a matrilineal marriage. Oh yeah. Oh bugger. Okay, he got away. Shit. At least he didn't find out it was us. Well it's probably quite obvious, considering our hatred for each other. Minus four hundred for unfaithful harlot. Wow. 
That is real hatred. Alright. We've had another son. He believes that this one was actually his. What a pleb. Adrian, all my hopes are on you. Um, I'm going to marry you to no one yet. We'll see what happens in the future. Oh no, the Pope died. I've got to seduce the new one. Ha. Pope seduction's hard, man. And on that note, I think we'll uh, leave this episode there. So thanks for watching, guys. If you've enjoyed the video, as usual, please like, comment, and subscribe. It helps my channel a lot, and it's much appreciated. So yeah, if you enjoyed, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you for the next one. See you later, guys.